Hi guys, it's Micah. I'm back. So I just came back literally yesterday from visiting my family in Montreal and it was a very nice visit and of course the highlight of my trip was visiting my favorite store which is the Louis Vuitton and I picked up a few stuff. Uh, my friend picked up a few stuff too and um, this video is going to be like a haul. And I decided to probably just make a two or three part video haul just because I don't want to bore you guys with a really, really long video. And let's get started. But first, before I show you the purchases, I just want to I just want to share with you um, the, the clay or the six key ring holder that I got for my birthday last December. Um, it, it was an online purchase and it wasn't a uh, hot stamp for me at the time but i really really wanted to get a hot stamping of my initials so i brought it to montreal with me and i had the girl at the louis vuitton store um do my initials uh hot stamp my initials and it's in gold and i think it's the medium medium size um lettering and i'm quite happy with it so now it's it's more like personal it's really really mine well it was mine before but it's more mine now so yeah i just thought i'd share with you um that little something that i got extra on the side when uh, i went to the store on to the unboxing or the haul and like uh, i said this here, here here's the receipt and it came in this brown envelope and it came with the business card from the sales associate that helped me and the receipt right here and the store where i went is in the montreal quebec uh, city and the very first item that i'm going to show you is actually probably the best item that i got um this time from louis vuitton and i got a little help from my friend here on youtube kv loves lv because she got one of this item just recently and i have been eyeing this item for a while now but i just could not um get a break on getting one um i live in a city where there's no louis vuitton so it's really hard for me to just go to the store and ask for one um, I tried calling the 800 number or the 866 number, but I still wasn't getting any luck with it because they're very, very picky about who to sell uh, this little, this particular item to. So anyway, KV loves LV. Thank you um, for your suggestion. And I actually, before the day that we left for Montreal, I had called and I spoke to this person, this associate uh, that helped me when I was there. Um, she, uh, I asked her if I if um, I wanted to get one of these items and if she would help me with it. And she said, oh my God, I have one right here in my hand. And I guess the customer or whoever ordered it didn't want it or they had an extra one. And she just decided to uh, put it on hold for me until I, until the next day, until I got there. So anyway, I'm going to show you what it is. And it came in this little drawer box. It came with its own dust bag. And the item is this little key bell. And I have been wanting one to dress up my Speedy 30, which is right here. And I just thought that I was so lucky to get my hands on one of these little guys here. And um, not only that, but the sales associate that helped me gave this to me for free. And, you know, what could be better than a freebie from Louis Vuitton? So anyway, here it is. And I have yet to figure out how to to uh, attach the keys on here and whatnot. But nevertheless, I'm so excited to have her. And I can't wait to dress up my Louis Vuitton Speedy with it. I just thought, I just think it's going to look amazing. And I ha I've already had my, my initial stamped on this side. But there's no collar. And so I wanted to add this for collar. So yeah, I can't wait to show you guys how it turns out. But anyway, this is a very nice treat for me. Mm -hmm. Moving on to the next purchase. Um, here it is. 
It came in this bag and it's very heavy but ever since I saw somebody on YouTube open one of these I have already set my heart on it right right from the second that I saw that person I think his name is hello Coco and he has one of these and eventually I I uh, saw that Miss Trina Roberts has one too and I believe KV loves LV has one too and um, anyway here it is um, let me show you guys came in this box very nice thin but extremely heavy let's take the, the cording off and let's take the cover off and here it is and this particular item that I picked up is the Louis Vuitton city bag natural history and uh, I just wanted to pick it up to add to my collection because I think it's a really really cool thing to have learned about the Louis Vuitton's um, more most famous bags and um, and learn about a little bit about the history of the bags and yeah I just thought that it's really really nice it's still sealed um, let's open it up one is not part of the book but anyway here's a little um, overview of the bags that they're going to mention inside the book and I believe it opens this way right there and the book itself is right here it's very nice I think I can't wait to go through it and read a little bit about the bags and yeah it's a very it's a very very beautiful presentation I love how the way they presented this bag or this uh, this book beautiful if you guys have any questions or comments just feel free to ask me and I'll uh, answer your, your 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 questions so um, the last item that I got for myself on this trip is this bag right here, as you can see, is gigantic right there. And um, I had to smile a couple of days ago because KV loves LV. I know I have been mentioning you a lot on this video. I'm so sorry if you're getting getting irritated by that. But um, I had to smile when you did your reveal of this particular bag um, just the other day because I couldn't wait to get home and do a reveal or unboxing myself and then to see you do it. I'm like, oh my God, it's like our bags are twins because they were bought probably on the same week. And um, so yeah, anyway, here it is. And I probably just gave it away um, what this item is. But anyway, I showed you the bag. And here is the box right here in the leather cording. So let's take the cording off. There you go. Let me just move back a little bit so you can see me better. All right, there it is. And it was a challenge, a total challenge, taking all these big boxes home on the plane because you know the, the our lag our luggage was very limited. But uh, needless to say, we had to pay for ex for excess baggage. But um, I don't care. I got my babies home and that's all that matters. So anyway, here she is. He, it came in this little dust bag. And the item that I got is the um, Delightful PM. Here you go. I know um, Renewed Gal has one and Nastasia has one too. and. 
Um, BJ Taylor has this particular bag in all the sizes and also Miss Sanders has this in the MM size and I wanted um, a Louis Vuitton bag that I can wear for for every day um, whether I'm going to work or wherever or whatever I'm dressed for um, I just think that this bag is very lightweight and very casual and um, it fits um, my lifestyle, my my everyday lifestyle, I think this is a perfect bag for it. Not too small, um, not too big, although this is small for me. I'm just used to having a really big bag, but I went with this size because that way I, I won't fill it up um, with a lot of stuff when I go out. So anyway, here she is. Um, this particular bag is actually um, my first piece that's made in US, and it has that cloth tag that a lot of people don't like. I don't really know if you can see, but on this side um, is, there it is, the cloth tag. It says made in US. And on the front here, it just says Le Louis Vuitton um, Paris. And same thing for the inside here. It says Le Louis Vuitton Paris. But that's okay. I don't really mind that a lot. But um, anyway, she is a gorgeous bag, very lightweight. Um, of course, I can't wait for the Vaquetta letter to patina. But um, anyway, here she is. Let me just do a modeling shot for you. Um, I'm 5'2", and this is how it looks on me. I just think it's, it's very casual. It's very, it's very, it's, it's, it's so me. I mean, I don't like my bags really, really structured, and I like just how it slouches a little bit. And the canvas is still pretty stiff right now, but I'm sure eventually it will soften up more, and it will slouch more. And I can't wait for that to happen. So anyway, here it is. It's a decent size, decent, decent size for a PM. So anyway... Um. I'm glad to have her in my collection. She is totally a beaut. There we go. All right. This concludes my uh, Louis Vuitton haul for this part. And um, stay tuned for the part two. And um, I will see you guys on my next video. Take care, guys.